And Carolina, that Disney area, a popular vacation spot, of course, so is our beaches. And now rental owners in Pinellas County will be able to make a little extra cash. Today, the county became the first in the Bay Area approved by the state to reopen those rentals just in time for Memorial Day weekend. Nightside's Josh Shadorowitz shows you the new cleaning requirements and the travelers that they're being told not to take reservations from right now. I'll tell you, it's been a challenge. For two months, Dennis Dettino's vacation rentals, like every other in our area, have sat vacant. Oh, it's, it's tremendous. In the first uh, the first 30 days, we lost a half a million dollars. So it is a relief to know short-term rentals can now reopen in Pinellas County. I'm feeling top. I, I, it's the best thing that's that's happened in a long time. This six-page plan approved Wednesday by the state lists more than two dozen precautions property managers must now take, like having extra time between stays to deep clean, making sure masks are worn by staff, and, as this for interesting, requiring that travelers from designated hot spots like New York can only book if they self-quarantine when they get here. Tatino's staff is also hanging signs like this after each unit is cleaned. All part, he says, of changes they have been preparing for during the downtime. So it's it's all in preparing to take care of the property and to take care of the buildings and then to take care of the people. Pinellas County says tourism brought in $9 billion last year. The Florida Vacation Rental Management Association says more than a quarter of the entire country's vacation rentals are right here in Florida. So it's sizable. Its executive director says the timing of this couldn't be better. Memorial Day overall is a big weekend. We had some property managers today that were already talking about they've got to call people and cancel bookings because they hadn't heard anything yet. So this is just a huge weight off the shoulders of many of those folks. And a huge win for Pinellas County. So which counties are cleared to take those rental reservations? Airbnb and Verbo included, by the way. Here's a map and you can see a bunch of them are in the panhandle as well as along our coast. They're good to go as well. Now, if you are planning to take a trip, we've got this posted right now on our 10 Tampa Bay Facebook page, along with a link to the case numbers in each county so you can make sure that you take that trip safely.